Hello and welcome everyone. Today in this SAP on AWS video, we'll be discussing how SAP customers start protecting their SAP HANA databases by using AWS Backup for SAP HANA. And the customers who are not running their SAP databases on HANA, they are running their SAP databases on any DB databases, how they will protect that database by using CXLink Backup. My name is uh, Soumya Shekhar Das. I'm a partner solutions architect with Amazon Web Services specializing SAP workloads. Today in this studio, I have Mario uh, with me from Syntax. So Mario, please introduce yourself. Thanks, Soumya. My name is Mario De Felipe. I'm a director at Syntax. Syntax is a proud uh, AWS premier partner focused on SAP workloads. Great to have you here, Mario. Thanks for inviting me. So let's directly dive deep into the solutions and uh, explain how this services works for our customers. So if you look at this uh, solution, uh, this service diagram here uh, on top, it is AWS Backup for SAP HANA. So AWS Backup for SAP HANA, it is, uh, it is an SAP certified application consistent uh, backup and restore solution for SAP HANA databases that are running on Amazon EC2 instance. Now, if you look at the left side here, this side, we are running AWS Backend Agent that is also running for SAP 100 databases on the same instance, like on the Amazon EC2 instance. And if you look at the right side where AWS SSM for SAP, like Systems Manager, that is running, and that keeps track of uh, the Amazon EC2 instances, the EC2 resources where uh, the SAP databases are installed, SAP 100 databases are installed. On top, AWS Backup, uh, which is a centralized solution for, uh, for data protection across all AWS resources. Now, when you are using a Systems Manager console, SSM console, basically uh, you can view any operational data and, uh, and automate any kind of operational tasks, like you can schedule your uh, backup, you can schedule the recurring backups, like recurring tasks for your SAP HANA databases. Now, once the backup is created, uh, it is absolutely controlled at the central place by using AWS Backup. So when you are using AWS Backup tool, you can actually set up policies, you can uh, tag the backups, you can create lifecycle uh, management policies, etc. on those uh, backup files. So with this, uh, I'll be uh, requesting you, Mario, to uh, let us know uh, about CXLink Backup solutions for uh, NADB databases. Okay. So essentially, um, CXLink Backup covers the full suite of uh, uh, non-HANA databases, uh, um, uh, the ability to back them up uh, into Amazon S3 directly. So one of the best benefits uh, that we can mention is that uh, the tool doesn't require uh, middleware, just in the same case as the AWS Backup for, for SAP HANA. Um, the tool is also SAP certified when applicable, right? And it boasts in both, uh, it runs on both flavors, uh, Linux uh, OS and Windows OS. Uh, tool um, will send, uh, the logs uh, will be centrally managed from the CXLink backup console. So customers will have a centralized tool to see the status of any backup uh, independent on which technology, which database technology they are running their SAP environments on, right? And the tool is extremely performant uh, with up to 12 terabytes uh, per hour. All right. Thank you. Thank you, Mario, for explaining uh, the CXLink backup solutions for us. It will be really useful for our SAP on AWS customers who are running uh, their SAP solutions on uh, non-HANA databases. Uh, so final question, right? Uh, how customers will get started uh, with CXLink Backup. CXLink Backup is available on the AWS Marketplace for customers to use. Well, that means that it will cover the full suite, like AWS Backup for SAP HANA, it will cover the SAP HANA databases, whereas CXLink Backup, it will cover the non-HANA databases. That means we are covering the entire SAP database, um, database portfolio. So uh, thank you all for watching this video. Please reach out to learn more how to get started with AWS Backup for SAP HANA as well as CXLink Backup. Thank you very much.